Yo, what's up guys? It's Pi who's here, the Crypto Pi. And today we're going to be talking about Bitcoin guys because Bitcoin will indicate what the market is doing. And we're on a five minute time frame here guys because the five minute shows me a huge green candle, right? With good volume. Uh, very happy to see that. This is uh, the tether chart to on Binance. So obviously the most volume is there, you know, except for BitMEX. But BitMEX is just madness, right? I mean, that is... Uh, big future volume so um yeah it, it, look at this guys right so this volume this this speaks to me all right so this speaks to me um if you just look at the volume right it, it's it's higher than than we've been for a while so that that's just good to see all right that's good to see in general guys so let's zoom out a little bit i mean the five minutes obviously a bit crazy right to look at so 15 minute um obviously a good volume as well uh but here was decent volume as well and you, you got this little run and then we made like this bart simpson head that went back down so be careful of that guys be careful of bart simpson heads and going back down right so um look at the 30 minute but we did go out of our triangle guys see this is what we were waiting for just patiently waiting we were in this consolidation zone very boring very 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 boring but um after that you get you know after having nothing you get volume and you know we get volatility now so now is the time to look for trades and you know i'll certainly keep you guys posted on on trades that i'm uh you know looking at but um for, for now guys it's looking absolutely good right so I, I like what i see here so this is just bitcoin uh let's take a look at ethereum as well ethereum also broke out it seems that let's just take a look real quick right so kind of like this um I, i'll just do this quickly right now right so um Kind of like that, right? Um, yeah, we broke out of that. So uh, that's just just good good to see, guys. So what am I looking to play? Um, I'm looking to play Ethereum just because there's bigger percentage gain in there than in um, than in Bitcoin, or perhaps perhaps guys, uh, well, Binance uh, Binance is already too high. So um, yeah, let's go back to uh, Bitcoin here. So on the one hour, guys. Obviously, we're overbought here. I do expect a little pullback, but overall, we're out of this triangle, so we should see a little move up, right? Whether, whether that will be to this 0.5 line, 6.9, uh, or even to 7K, or, or you know, like we, we obviously have this uh, downtrend here. So um, put the downtrend on, on your uh, on your um, chart, guys. So basically, it starts from here up to, on the 10K and just, uh, you know, go to the tools here and go to ray and just click once click twice and you have the ray just like i have it right and then um you can um play on that right so this is definitely a big downtrend that we need to you know be careful of but here's the apex point guys so we got the 7k here plus that downtrend and then basically this whole zone right i'm, I'm just gonna mark it here Right, we have the apex there. We have an apex there. So this zone is very important, guys. Right, I I don't like having all these blocks on my chart, but uh, yeah, there there you go. So we didn't break down further, but we broke to the upside for now. Um, that doesn't mean that we will not go down further after we hit here. Okay, just play it day by day, look at it day by day, and look for good trades. All right, and uh, you know try to make some profit. That that is uh, what I would do. Right, so. Um, if we look here right now in the shorter term picture I mean the the me medium picture so the four hour you see we got denied by this 55 EMA for now right but we're above the 21 EMA so what I expect is a pullback to this 21 EMA around you know and then uh, we'll actually try and get above this right um, I don't think this this will be it just yet um, uh, you know we can definitely go higher daily still has uh, you know watch out when the daily gets up here though guys 45 because you see there's huge resistance right so um yeah uh definitely watch out for that but that's daily guys so it definitely has some uh, a bit to grow so one hour yeah just uh pl i'd say play it on the one hour for now so if you want to get in uh where's my tool here uh take fibonacci so guys, someone had a question in my telegram about Fibonacci, right? So when you have Fibonacci, you need to take your low point to your swing high, right? So in this case, we had a low here, right? Established, you see all these wicks, 
So you just simply take your swing low to your swing high, even though we don't know if this is the high yet, because the, the candle's not finished yet. But for now, it's, it's, it's up here, right? So swing low to swing high. Then we look at the 0.5s around the 65.34, which is also coincidental with all this uh, Bart Simpson here up here, right? So, um, yeah, it's it's looking uh, it's looking pretty good that it will actually retrace to about there. Um, so right right around here, right? Um, that is how we do it, guys. Swing low to swing high. All right. So I hope that answered your question about Fibonacci, how to how to use it. Swing low to swing high, and also if you uh, want to get to the you know back up so this Fibonacci is a little different because I want to calculate the the road back up right so what what I do then is you take um, swing high so up here guys to swing low right which is right around here so and then you get this uh, this Fibonacci all right so there's two ways to do it right for going back up you go from swing high to swing low and if you want to get in on the retracement, you go from swing low to swing high. Um, that is just how you do it. Um, so, yeah. And then what you could also do is take a look at Fibonacci, um, like confluence, right? So if we take this one, for example, then you take another one from here to here. And now you see that actually closer to the, the 38.2 here and the 236, here we have a lot of confluence and we have here a lot of confluence as well but i i don't i don't use that too much right but you could definitely use that um so yeah definitely just wait for a pullback and then um get in in whatever altcoin that you want because i think we're gonna see a little bull run now guys we're gonna see a little bull run uh up to about this right and uh, at least another wave right guys uh, I was right as well with the, the other wave that we did um, where I played Ethereum let's go back uh, what what did I play um, so you had this little move and then you had this move right so this little move is gonna be this little move and then you have an at least another move right for that uh, even you know this was probably ABC but it can also be a one two three four five so I expected another wave but that wasn't there so the the wave after that is more um, dangerous than than this one but hey so maybe Bitcoin goes even higher guys so see that's why I cannot really use this Fibonacci yet because it the candle didn't end yet right you want to wait for the candle to end in order to use your Fibonacci um, you know you want to establish a high and so you want to see a drop in the next candle so then you establish the high if it goes further up then you don't still don't have a high so yeah see uh, it wants to go further so we'll, we'll have to see guys we'll have to see um, but don't just FOMO in just wait for a retrace and then um, look for an altcoin to play and uh, you know get some profits guys right this is gonna be uh, volatility again whether it's to the up or downside like I said there's money to be made so this is to the upside which is even better uh, so there's money to be made guys right um, just wait patiently for that uh, retracement jump in and uh, look for the next one all right so let's say this is the high guys if this is the high then what I'm looking for you already know right I would be looking for the negative 236 to negative 618 so in between 67 and 68 um, that's where I would uh, look to uh, take some profit but obviously wait patiently because um, it's 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 not just gonna reverse just like boom right it, it will show you some kind of candle with a wick like the, here right it will show you some kind of candle it's not just gonna pump and dump and then you know it's gonna stay up there for a bit so you have time to take profits but that is just the general area that I think it could go to right um, if you look at a uh, Fibonacci extensions after you get in on the retrace so um, you know that that's pretty much what what I see right now guys we're breaking out of this triangle which is great just wait for a pullback and jump in on your favorite altcoin uh, or maybe you just want to play Bitcoin play it safe you know that's that's up to you but uh, anyways guys it's looking great so you know uh, I'm glad to see this uh, you know whether it was to the upside or the downside uh, I I would have been fine with both guys uh, because I'm I'm in uh, I'm in quite a lot of tether uh, and and fiat so I could have also shorted the market but upsides obviously better because I still have a lot of altcoins so uh, this is good for my altcoins guys uh, so yeah definitely um, look, looking good guys you know if, if we get a retracement 
I'll jump in probably on Ethereum once again or maybe uh, let's take a look at ontology real quick guys oh, where's ontology ontology that's ontology Bitcoin well, where's my ontology USDT I have it somewhere right? uh, I cannot find it for now uh, I cannot find it guys on USDT here we go so yeah um, because this did uh, a lot of percentage. Look at that, guys, eleven percent. So um, yeah, definitely, um, I'm I'm looking to play ontology. I think uh, so. Yeah, retrace, and then I'm I'm gonna play it or either Ethereum or ontology. That's what I'm looking at. So um, yeah, that is uh, pretty much the play that I'm gonna do. Oh, now it's here. Look at that. Uh, it's kind of magical. So um, yeah, guys, that's uh, that's pretty much it for this video, right? Also, if you're not in my Telegram yet, join up with the CryptoPies blog where you can ask me any questions, you can ask other people questions. It's just a great chat box to be in, right? So join up with that. JP Fortune, I hope I helped you out with the Fibonacci question. So it's from swing low to swing high in order to get in on the retracement. And if you want to uh, calculate the way back up, you go from swing high to swing low in order to, you know, see all the Fibonacci levels on the way back up, right? They're all resistances. So um, yeah, I hope I helped you with that. ICO Moon Tracker, uh, yeah, you're right. H Stack is making commercials for uh, the World Cup, so that's pretty cool. Um, then we have a uh, Crypto Boss, yeah, definitely nice volume coming in here, right, dude? You're, you're absolutely right. So, uh, you know, and I post this chart before, guys. The volatility well, was kind of back to the downside, but then I thought it would break to the downside, but it didn't. So we stayed in the triangle, and um, yeah, and now we got a pop to the upside, so that's good. Um, yeah. Just uh, wait patiently for the retracement, guys, and uh, get in, right? Also, guys, join up with the CryptoPies feed where I post all my videos, post about upcoming ICOs. When I find one, guys, I'll tell you to whitelist for it. I hope you all whitelisted for Airblock if you were eligible to, uh, because that is tomorrow, um, very early in the morning for me. But uh, yeah, I'll be there and, uh, you know, try to get my Ethereum in there for a nice flip. All right, guys, keep in mind the keyword flip all right since we don't know where this market is going i'm definitely going to flip it i'm not going to hold long term or anything because we don't know where this market's going right now so i'm flipping it all right as soon as it gets on exchange i see a three four five x i'm out all right so um that is what i'm planning to do with airblock and i honestly think it can 3x or whatever because it's a super low market cap all right so that is what i'm looking to do guys with my airblock so yeah both telegrams will be in the description below and if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe hit that post notification button and if you've got any questions at all leave a comment below and i'll see you guys in the next video